Hi, it's Karen Anderson with Champagne and Parisi Real Estate. Today, we are interviewing a new business that has just reopened, and it's Dirty Blonde Hair Salon, located at 289 East Palmetto Park Road in Boca Raton. And I'm here now with Michelle Melser, who was the manager for Dirty Blonde. Where are you, Michelle? Hello. <laughs> Hi there. Hi. So tell me, how is it with you now opening up on Monday? Um, how's the new normal and doing business uh, with the hair salon amongst this uh, COVID-19? It has been really great. Everybody has been so welcoming and so excited to be back. We have a lot of new guidelines that we are using now. Um, whenever somebody comes into the salon, they have to be greeted at the door. They can't come in until their operator is ready. They, everyone is wearing masks, gloves, everything is being sanitized after every client, the brushes. Um, we are, we're really doing everything we have to do and everyone has been patient and amazing. They're just so happy to be back. Well, I could imagine, um, and there's certainly a tremendous need for people to feel normal again and feel good about themselves. Absolutely. Absolutely. And, you know, a lot of things have changed. As, you know, before we would serve champagne and serve cookies or bagels, and now, you know, we can't do any of that. But everybody is just so understanding and so happy to be back. Now, I know prior um, to opening up, your salon was offering a really great service curbside, and you were distributing um, hair color for people to get their touch-ups. So will that continue for those people that cannot come into the salon? Absolutely. We are continuing the curbside pickup for people because there are some people that are not ready to come out yet. So that is continuing. We're also selling brush sets, which is the client can buy their own brushes. We have a kit with um, three different types of brushes and clips. I'll give you a little showing of that. And they can use those instead. So that will be their very own that they can take home with them. And this way, they're using those instead of our brushes, which we do sterilize, but we're using them on everybody. So that's been a really nice thing that the clients have loved. That's, that's really a great idea. So tell me what services that you're providing right now, other than, of course, you're doing hair cutting and coloring and blowouts. We're doing all of our services, haircuts, coloring, blowouts, keratin. Um, it's being done a little bit different than it was before. When someone has their color done, they go outside to process, or they can stay in their car and text them when we're ready, or the colorist will go to them. But we're doing the curbside, we're doing the brush sets, we're doing all of our, um, all of our services are up and running. Well, and we're just trying to service everybody. Well, that's great. And um, I know, you know, you were even selling gloves and masks at the curb during. We're, we're still doing that. We have the gloves and masks and people really, they come in from everywhere. Can you, you know, do you still have gloves and masks? And we do. We're selling those. We're selling um, the gloves, the masks. We're selling hand sanitizer. Um, we have everything that they need. Well, that's a wonderful uh, service, not just on the hair end of it, but just a community service to everyone to give them their personal protective equipment um, is, is really uh, something to, to note. Um, Michelle, thank you so much for uh, joining me this morning and um, really excited thank to see you. businesses up and operating. I think it's making everything oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. so much better so good. about what's going on. So good. Yes, yes, yes. So but I am uh, very excited and thank you. Huh? I said if somebody wants to make an appointment, uh, the phone number to The reach phone number is 
6686. Great. So that's 561 571 6686. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you so much, Michelle. Oh, thank you, Karen. See you soon. Bye bye. Bye.